one uh, news item before we get into SmackDown and Rampage, and that was a Page's uh, post earlier today writing that July 7th, I should I should specify because there's like how many pages in professional wrestling, this mm. being uh, uh, Soraya, um, the former Page, I guess it will be soon enough, says that July 7th will be the last day with WWE. I'm so thankful and I appreciate the opportunities that the company has given me. I will always be appreciative of the company that took in an 18-year-old British pale emo girl that didn't look like your average diva, giving me the chance of a lifetime and making me feel like a superstar. I know after my neck injury taking me out of in-ring status it was pretty hard to keep me around for as long as you did and that i'm thankful for too thank you to the universe you guys are the most passionate group of fans i've ever seen i think the toughest part weirdly enough is having to let the page name go but soraya is a hell of a name kudos to my mom for that one fyi i'm not saying i'll never be in the ring that day will most certainly come again wherever the return may be and that is uh, her message so indicating that she believes july 7th she will be uh, done with her WWE career. Of course, she has not had a match since December of 2017. And that's a long time uh, with, without a wrestling match, but certainly uh, not even um, dancing around it, pretty much indicating like she expects to to wrestle after this contract. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, she basically is telling us that, you know, she can't be cleared in this company, but it doesn't mean she doesn't believe she she's able to compete and that she seems to be confident that she'll be able to find clearance somewhere else. So, um, yeah, it's, it's interesting. Of course, you know, you, you, as fans, of course we have our concerns and you, we have to, you know, trust the medical professionals that are out there. I'm, I'm hoping that, you know, wherever she ends up, um, she is getting the, the proper, um, you know, doctors and, and whatnot to, to judge whether or not she's actually okay to compete. Yeah, I mean that will be the the case, and I mean you can look at you can look at many situations where over the last number of years, like WWE has been uh, very cautious about certain performers, even ones that, I mean you you can look at a, a Jeff Hardy and how the, and some people will feel like they weren't maybe handling him properly, but I think they also did have like we were not seeing them thrown into ladder matches, for instance, on on WWE. I think they they had a certain they were certainly being very cautious with with Brian Danielson at the same time and with Paige. Um, I'm not going to necessarily fault that, but I mean, for her, she is looking at wanting to continue her career, and I don't doubt she will find that clearance if she seeks it out. But um, yes, this looks to be bringing an end to the Paige chapter with WWE and where she ends up next. It's, I mean, you can look in an AEW. I mean, there's there's not a whole lot of options that are out there unless you're looking for a couple one-offs um, that are not AEW. Uh, honestly, yeah, it's hard for me. I mean, I think she's of a star level that um, would interest certainly Tony Khan. I mean, she had a movie made about her for crying out loud, you know, starring Florence Pugh uh, and made by Dwayne, the rock Johnson. So of all the names that Maybe, are currently and Vince Vaughn was just there. Like the seeds <laughs> were planted at double or nothing. That, that 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 is correct. Yeah, of all the names currently on the AEW roster, um, I think she would be the biggest one, biggest name immediately uh, upon injury. So she is somebody that I could definitely, and she can wrestle. You know, at least you know from from what we we at least that was uh, five years ago now. Wow, that's a long break. Yes, yes. and she can also t- keep her twitch, of course. Of course, yeah, uh, great point as well. Okay, let's get into uh, SmackDown from Battle. Oh, 